What you got there, noob noob? I have a fortune cookie. Oh, what does it tell you? It tells me that we're gonna watch disappointing trailers of Blairiel in Hocus Pocus 2. German. All right, it appears the D23 just happened. And I guess we're going to be taking a look at some things because the future for Disney Plus does not look bright. It does not look bright at all. It doesn't. It looks a little disappointing, but we'll talk about it. As so sad. So you sound like Eeyore. Okey dokey. Oh, ball, oh my God. Was the Mandarin just Eeyore? I believe but he Asian? was. He was Asian or? He was Asian or. Let's take a look at what we got. First up, we got Hocus Pocus 2. I've never seen Hocus Pocus. Neither have I. I think it has ugly witches. Ugly old women in it? Ugly white witches. Oh my gosh. It is a little, maybe it's like just a Karen story. It's Hocus Pocus 2, a Karen story. Oh my God. We have Bette Midler, Sarah Jessica Parker, and Kathy Najimi. And, uh, yeah, I did not see the first one. And from the trailer, I'm not going to be watching the second one. And the only person who actually speaks in the whole trailer that's a witch is Bette Midler. Oh. The others don't speak at all. Oh, my God. Yeah, because we just watched it. Oh, no. Yeah. Not sure what's going on here. I don't really... I don't get it. I don't know what the first one is about, so I don't really know what this one's going to be about. Witches and pocusing and hocusing. The movie is set 29 years since someone lit the black flame candle and resurrected the 17th century sisters, and they are looking for some revenge in Salem. I've been to Salem. I don't recall any actual not. witches. I have not. Salem's kind of cool. It's an interesting place Hubie to go. Hubie Halloween looks better than this movie. <laughs> That's pretty brutal. Cause and that Adam was- Sandler was literally retarded (laughs) yeah you can say that so oh boy so i'm a hard pass but let's go on to the rest of d23 a lot of video games oh boy though there was a lot of d every major announcement except they this article from uh, polygon does not mention hocus pocus 2 because it's it's too old incomplete too many ugly white women in it a lot of uh, additions that have nothing to do with Jedi or superheroes because, yeah, they've virtually destroyed Star Wars and they're working on destroying the Marvel Universe. It's cool. It's cool. We don't care. Yeah. Not upset about it at all. Knights of the Old Republic, at least there's that. Oh, no. that Remember, that got delayed and moved to another studio. Fuck. It is now, yeah. Nope. Okay, so there's an animated musical about the star its heroes are always wishing upon. What Nobody the hell are you talking about? What is that? Inside Out's getting a prequel? Or uh, a no, sequel? I don't understand. What are they wishing upon? I don't know. The magic star? I don't know. I don't care. Not interested. Next. Marvel's getting an AR game from the makers of... Hard Pass. Mm-hmm. Captain America and... Black Panther getting a team up game from the Uncharted director. I'm not sure I give a shit about that either. I don't remotely. Nope. I'm pretty sure Black Panther wasn't involved in World War II. I don't think so. If you look at the continuity, w- weren't they just. I feel like the Wakandans were isolationists, right? Am I confused? I think so. Yeah. I, I think it's based on a. Sounds like a reboot. Like a 2010 limited series. Seems like it undermines all of the Black Panther movie. Oh my god. Whatever. Inside Out is getting a sequel. Did we talk about that? What is going on here? But Bill Hader and Mindy Kaling were offered a pittance and they rejected. Oh my gosh, so they won't come back? You mean like the main stars? I don't know if they were the main stars. I I mean, they were stars. Never watched this piss poor movie. You never watched it? No. It was all right. I saw it. It won the Academy Award for Best Animated Feature. It was nominated for Best Original Screenplay. I think it's a little on the nose. It wasn't, like, amazing. 
it was just fine. Yeah. I'm not excited for... It's, yeah. Bill Hader and Minnie Kaling are reportedly not returning as feared and discussed because they won't take $100,000. How dare they? The they nerve. want more money. The first trailer of The Little Mermaid shows off Haley Bailey. Her name is Haley Bailey. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Not Halle Berry. And she is, no, much uglier than Halle Berry. Oh, that is rude. It's dash. She does, if you see this picture of her, she kind of looks like an alien and needs her eyes squished closer together. Yeah. It's not great. She is very wide set I eyes. think she's a good singer. Uh, you have any proof of that? Um, but other than that, I'm Shows not, off her singing chops. It shows off, yeah, literally Part nothing else. Of you Every, will, Melissa McCarthy's in it. Do you really think oh, that's going to Oh, isn't she good? Ursula? She is. Oh, my God. Javier Bardem is going to be King Triton. Makes You're no sense. You're fucking kidding me. Nope. Davey Diggs voices Sebastian. Nope. Aquafina is going to be Scuttle. Nope. No, I'm done. Uh huh. It's, it, we're putting this and in. And Jacob route, Tremblay gonna, is gonna be flounder. I don't know who that is. He sounds gay. But uh, no, fuck no, fuck no. Why? <laughs> I'm upset that you told me this information. The new movie is directed by Rob Marshall, who directed Into the Woods. I don't give a shit what he. Mary did. Poppins Return. What? With Emily Blunt. Oh no, Moana and Encanto. Lin Manuel Miranda and Alan Menken are gonna be the composers. They're going to write four new songs. That means they're all going to be like. We're woke as woke fuck. No, they're going to be like. Uh, they we all have the like same exact. They're, they're, all their songs are written in the same key. And they're all. They have the same lyrical base. Because Lin-Manuel Moran is like. It's all. I, I promise you. Watch this video. You're going to go back and every song is going to be like <laughs> They're all going to have that same exact key, I promise you. Uh, Lego Star Wars is getting another 30 characters. Don't care. Sure. Don't care at all. Yeah. Tron is getting a game. I don't need that either. Nope. Don't care. Don't There's a whole game show. This seemed to be more about games than it seemed to be about movies. Very confusing. It was about Things I didn't need or want. I don't need any of these at all. So we're not excited about any of this. Is there one thing you were even remotely excited uh, about? That this video... She-Hulk. Oh, She-Hulk is getting two. a sequel. Yeah. I need more She-Hulk dating. Oh my God. Yes. They need just a entire season of her dating and getting railed by different men. <laughs> just different men on a daily basis. Or her railing different men. Whatever you, whichever one you want. Cause apparently okay. all the men that she dates in she Hulk form just want to just get taken advantage of. Just take me baby. Just pick them up like a small child, put them to bed, tuck them in, give them the business and then make them breakfast in the morning. Wow. Yeah. Fair enough. Fair enough. Well, not gonna lie, I want a fucking Big Mac right now. <laughs> You're a dirty, dirty girl. I am. Anyway, that's all we have here today. Make sure you uh, check out our other videos. We do all sorts of stuff. We do a bunch of 10 second reviews. Be sure to check those out. You can also check out our full length audio podcast. We talk every Friday night. And you can catch it either here on YouTube. It also shows up on other places. You can also catch it on the audio format on iTunes, Stitcher, Spotify, all those other great places. And more, it's free to you, free to me, free to everyone. Unlike Disney, which costs like a million dollars per night. It does. Anyway, if you don't like and subscribe, there is the possibility that Noob Noob does this. I will dress up like Sarah Michelle... Not Michelle Michelle Geller. <laughs> Who's the ugly bitch in Hocus Pocus? She oh, Sarah Jessica horse Parker. Face. I will dress up like Horse Face McGee and haunt you for at least seven fucking business days. Why? That's yeah. the only curse you put in this. Specifically entire business days, not regular days. So if we're on a holiday, fuck you, buddy. You're getting an extra day of me. Yeah, be prepared for that. Unless you subscribe. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> I thought you were going to take the, the weekends off. Well, obviously. <laughs> Did I work on the weekends? <laughs> Never. Daddy got shit to do. Well, anyway, uh, <laughs> check, check this video out more. We love y'all. We are 
On to the next one, apparently.